Are you a fan of Slow Horses, the spy thriller series starring Gary Oldman as Jackson Lamb? If so, you might be wondering when the fourth season will be released and what it will be about. In this video, we will give you all the details you need to know about Slow Horses Season 4. First of all, when can we expect to see the new season? Well, the good news is that the filming for Season 4 took place in the spring of 2023 and has been completed. The bad news is that it might take a while before we get to watch it. The first season of Slow Horses was released in April 2022 and the second season followed the same year. However, there was a gap of a whole year until the release of Season 3 on November 29, 2023. That means we could have to wait until the end of 2024 before we get back to Slough House, the home of the Slow Horses, the misfit MI5 agents who have been sidelined for various reasons. And we can only imagine how messy Jackson Lamb's office will be by then. So, who will be coming back for Season 4? A sneak peek at the end of Season 3 finale reveals that many of our favorite Slow Horses will be back for the next season. Of course, Slough House wouldn't be the same without Gary Oldman as Jackson Lamb, the grumpy, rude, and brilliant leader of the group. In Season 4, he will be joined by returning cast members including Jack Lowden as River Cartwright, Kristen Scott Thomas as Diana Taverner, Saskia Reeves as Catherine Standish, Amy Fian Edwards as Shirley Dander, Cadiff Kerwin as Marcus Longridge, Christopher Chung as Roddy Ho, Rosalind Eliezer as Louisa Guy, and Jonathan Price as David Cartwright. While they are not in the trailer, it is also possible that Samuel West may pop up as Peter Judd, the conservative MP who has a history with Lamb, and Sophie Okanito as Ingrid Tenney, the disgraced ex-head of MI5 who was ousted by Taverner in Season 3. The preview also introduces us to some new faces, such as Hugo Weaving as a potential villain, James Callis as one of Taverner's associates at MI5, and Ruth Bradley as a new character who is welcomed to the delights of Slough House by Lamb in his usual sarcastic manner what will happen in Season 4. The fourth season of Slow Horses is based on Mick Herron's novel Spook Street, which follows the slow horses as they deal with personal secrets and failures. The official synopsis for the novel reveals that some of the action involves River's grandfather David, who began to show signs of memory loss and dementia in Season 3. Retired from the intelligence service, David Cartwright still knows where the skeletons are hidden, but when he forgets that secrets are supposed to stay buried, there is suddenly a target on his back. Jackson Lamb worked with David back in the day, and he knows better than most that this is no innocent old man. So when River's panic button raises the alarm at intelligence service headquarters, Lamb will do whatever he thinks necessary to protect an agent in peril. There are also loose ends from the season 3 finale, to be tied up. At the end of the season, River leaked important documents that revealed some dodgy goings-on at MI5 under Ingrid Tenney's leadership. By the final scene, Taverner had stepped up to take Tenney's place as the head of MI5. His first task was to fire Lamb, but Lamb had other plans. He told Taverner that he had evidence that would expose her involvement in the cover-up of a murder. He also told her that he had killed Charles' partner, the former boss of Standish, who was a traitor, who sold secrets to the Russians. Taverner agreed to let Lamb keep his job, but she warned him that she would be watching him closely. Showrunner Will Smith told the reporter in an exclusive interview that there will be repercussions for River's leak in Season 4, but they will be more left field than directly related to what he leaked. He also said that River's relationship with his grandfather will change dramatically in the new season. The main thing is the fracture that occurs when River is going against his grandfather for the first time and that's a big thing for him. He starts to see his grandfather in a new light and he starts to make his own judgments and not just toe the line. The next series is sad with what happens between River and David, he said. Catherine Standish, Slew House's reliable office administrator, also faces changes in the next season. After Lamb shockingly told her that her former boss Charles' partner was a traitor who sold secrets to the Russians, she quit and walked away from Lamb and Slew House. But she will be back in some capacity in Season 4. It remains to be seen whether she will discover Lamb's secret that he killed partner for his treachery. That's all we know so far about Slow Horses Season 4. Are you excited to see the new season? Who is your favorite Slow Horse? Let us know in the comments below and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. Thanks for watching.